morning in the morning. It's actually four o'clock, so it's really, really early. We are heading to family vacation. I am so excited at four o'clock in the morning. How can I be that way? But I'm still a little bit in jet lag. I just arrived in Germany. I will fly to Munich to family vacation. We have a really nice hotel. Like each year we spend a very, very nice week there and relax. It's like an activity hotel. So you can play tennis, go hiking, like be really active with your kids. So we've been there since we were like literally kids. I was uh, I think four years old. So ever since we've been um, going there and we know all the waitresses and all the people who work there. It's really, really nice. Proper family vacation. <laughs> yeah, now we're heading to the airport. It's gonna be really hectic because I heard the airport in Germany where I live is really packed because it's summer vacation, everybody wants to go. That's why we're heading out really early. But I will bring you guys along and film a little bit of my family vacation. I'm excited. Yeah, let's go to the airport. <laughs> Good morning, beautiful people. I woke up at 4.30. It's the jet lag, so don't worry. I'm not like a complete fitness fanatic, but maybe I am. I went to the gym at 5 o'clock. They weren't open, so I had to wait till 6. I did some shoulders and weight training since I've been doing a lot of strength training at F45, which I really, really like. Instead of only cardio. And I'll have a little mix, take maybe my fitness game to the next level. Today, I think the weather will be great, but maybe a little bit of rain later. Let's see. I have a little bit of a tan. My allergies are so bad. Like they have these, I don't know what they're called in English, I think holes, but they have like little things that fly around when it's summer here in Germany and it's a pain like you get headache and your nose is all clumped up i hate that like this is way worse here than when i am in sydney so i will fly back to sydney really really soon maybe we're gonna play some tennis with the family we're gonna be really active like we always are also guys i dyed my hair i really really like that color like still natural because it's like um I don't know if you can see this, but it's like a little bit with dark. I don't know how to call it in English. My English is very bad right now. Sorry, really early. And now we're heading to breakfast. I'm going to bring you guys along. I'm excited to start the day and be done with the gym already. Yeah, but I'm actually missing Sydney a lot. A lot, a lot, a lot. I miss the energy. I miss the people. I miss my boyfriend a lot. Can't wait to go back. On the tennis court. I'm here with my sister. Do you want to say hi? Hi! <laughs> We're gonna play some tennis. I think my dad is gonna come along and yeah, let's see who wins. <laughs> this is the most precious wellness spa area and they have also a hairdresser there and like a little shop where you can buy perfume and makeup over here. And there's the pool. Okay, I don't know why the light is really bad, but I'm off to dinner and I hate wearing makeup right now, especially when you have like a little tan. I just, I don't know, I don't like it. Good morning. So, 6 a.m. and I am ready for the gym. I told you I want to take you guys along. Yeah, it's so nice. This is like a whole room just for 
dancing and workouts. I'm feeling kind of sick. I hate that. I hate when the throat is like itchy. But the breakfast here is so, so good. So I'm excited about that. I'm gonna work really hard. <laughs> gonna have a big breakfast afterwards. Also, my training is so good. Yesterday I had, I trained arms, like a lot of strength. Today I'm gonna train core. I'm kind of feeling like a bodybuilder. <laughs> So this is my fit check. These pants are so cool and I'm still very tired. <laughs> Here's the full fit check. So, <laughs> so and I really like the shirt. I got it in Sydney. It's a store that I've never heard before it's called um, Cotton On. And they have like really basic shirts and I love that for sports. I think it's cute. Hey guys, so today was such an amazing relaxed day and me and my sister we talked for like five hours or six so we end up laying at the pool and yeah just talking for hours which was great that's the best part about family vacation and I feel like it's kind of turning into a ritual like a ritual a ritual like um ritual yeah I don't know how to call it but <laughs> yeah we do it like every family vacation we sit down and it kind of happens like we sit down and talk for six hours straight and I love that yeah and then we had a sauna experience it was really really nice it was so refreshing but i sweated so hard and then jumped right into cold water afterwards it was the best feeling ever i really asked myself why i don't do this every day your endorphins and everything like you just feel like a newborn so i'm gonna do that tomorrow as well other than that me and my sister we talked about how she would live with me she would be so much more into sports she is really really fit but she would be a lot more fitter because or I don't know like if you would live with me you know I'm gonna <laughs> push you to work out with me and eat healthy 80 20 you know all the time and just enjoy life but still eat healthy and feel good about yourself that made me so happy but that was also a reminder or is maybe also a reminder for you guys surround yourself with people that inspire you and create the best version of yourself I don't know that's just what I thought and wanted to say to you because it's just so important and it's so addictive when you're surrounding yourself with happy people and just people who have such an amazing lifestyle it just flips a switch and can actually turn your life around that made me so happy so come live with me and I'm gonna <laughs> I'm gonna train with you every day and motivate you every day no I mean I can't do that but with the social media I can reach to so much people at just one time and if I do a personal like a nutrition coach or a personal trainer I think it wouldn't be that effective now I can motivate from Africa or Brazil or France I can motivate you guys from here all over the world that's why i love social media i think it's such a gift i didn't really thought about that before now i've like grown into it i feel so happy that i'm able to share and to motivate you all at the same time so also i'm now really really hungry i haven't ate in a long time because i ate a lot of breakfast a lot of eggs <laughs> but now i'm heading to dinner so we just had breakfast and I'm really full. We're actually gonna drive like half an hour and go shopping with my sister. <laughs> and afterwards, maybe we're gonna play some tennis, I don't know. But I will see you probably at dinner. Quick little fit check. So these pants I just bought today. <laughs> the shirt is from Sydney. I don't know where I bought it. I think cotton on, I'm not sure. But it's just a simple cozy look. <laughs> Sometimes you have like moments where you feel yourself even though you don't have makeup on and then you have moments where you're like Holy sh! I look like a piece of garbage and that's life. I think that's totally fine. You can't look perfect every day it's stupid. It's that's why I think social media is sometimes super toxic. You think those people look perfect every other day or like every day and that's just not the case. So that's why I love Emma Chamberlain. She sometimes addresses things in her podcast that you think certain things are normal and they're just not normal and you it's just uh, I have so many thoughts. Sometimes I think I have to do a podcast myself because some things are just not reality and I think it's 
super important to address certain topics especially when you're in the social media industry maybe one day maybe one day i will do a podcast and address all the things and thoughts that i have during the day Good morning. <laughs> Are you ready for the gym to make some gains? I'm all alone in the gym. It's early. We love that. The gym is so cool. I mean, this is a hotel gym. Love it. I finally put... Oh. <laughs> I finally put some makeup on. I'm very tired, I don't know why. Maybe it's because of my allergy. But today we played tennis with my grandma and my grandpa watched us, which was really, really nice. So it was like a really, really heavy family dynamic. I'm now excited for dinner and gonna take you guys along. My lashes are so, I don't know. They're just different. Blame it on the allergy. Just had a pre-snack because I was so hungry. My family isn't at dinner yet. But I was. I mean, look at the salad buffet. They have dates wrapped in bacon. It's one of my favorite snacks. But let's skip that. When I was really, really heavy, I used to eat that a lot. Okay, you're never alone in this hotel, which makes it really hard for me to talk with the camera. But what I wanted to say is that dates wrapped in bacon. You guys, if you haven't tried it, I don't know if it's German. I think it's French, but not sure. But it's so, so good, but so unhealthy. It's just, it consists of sugar and fat and it's just not healthy, but it's so good. If you haven't had that, you have to try it. What hast du für eine junge Freundin? Und die, die sie haben, Menschen? Du riechst gut. Wo steht dein Bett? Was muss ich Da sie. <laughs> good morning i'm off to the gym i have a little bit of a tan um so i'm not red anymore and my allergy is killing me especially in the morning i'm probably gonna train my arms today and a little bit of core i'm excited for breakfast again that's so holiday <laughs> it's like i'm really on vacation <laughs> We just had breakfast and now we're doing a little hike with my grandma and my grandpa and um, yeah, let's go. And there's the family, all ready for the hike, but we're so active. Oh, yeah. Another day with makeup on. We had a lovely hike with my grandpa and my grandma and the whole family. It was a lovely day, but also I'm very exhausted now. We went to a restaurant, then had a drink there, and then all the way back and headed to the pool and did some work there. And also I might have to do my pictures. I don't know if you guys have the same struggle, but keeping pictures in order and saving them, I don't know, it's just ridiculous. I think now I have so much material and so many pictures and I don't know if I should put them to iCloud or if I do it all on a little hard drive. If you have any tips please let me know because I want just like a quick simple way and I know the full capacity will be full um, from my iPhone soon so it's always a struggle always have been a struggle so if you guys have any tips please please let me know you can always um, also text me on Instagram DM me tomorrow I have a call with my agent and discuss some cool events that are happening maybe next week and also in the summer is a really really cool event which I'm probably gonna go to and I'm probably gonna fly all the way back to Hamburg for this so I'm excited but not excited about the flight it's like a 30 hour flight yeah now I'm as always excited for dinner I'm gonna bring the camera with me yeah off to dinner my stomach is full and I'm tired and I'm always 
always walking the stairs. I never take the elevator. <laughs> Good night. Good morning. So today I slept in. So I woke up at six o'clock and then I laid down again and it was the best decision ever. Also because of my allergy. But then I usually can't sleep again, but this time I could and it was amazing. So I slept till 9.30 and now I'm on to breakfast. <laughs> my voice is kind of cracky. And then I'm gonna do a workout maybe later in the afternoon. Let's see. And maybe I play tennis, don't know, but that's what I love about vacation. It's not a must and it's not like you have to keep your routine. Um, it's about relaxation and hearing what's best for your body. And yeah, I really enjoyed it and now I'm really enjoying breakfast. I'm excited for the day. Yeah, I'm gonna see you guys at breakfast. Wow. Yeah, das ist viel besser hier. Conny, kennst du das, ne? Nee. Ja, Conny. Conny geht in den Zoo. The recommendation of my dad. <laughs> So now that I woke up a little later than usual, I'm going to hit the gym now. So it's five o'clock. Yeah, I'm ready. I also got a little sunburn, which is not good at all. I had a call, actually, a two hour call in the sun and I wasn't aware <laughs> that I was like completely in the sun. And now I look like a tomato. And yeah, I really need to work on that because otherwise I get skin cancer and we don't want that. So don't ever forget to wear sun screen yeah i'm now ready for the gym actually i'm not really ready but i just have to go not excited about it but you have those days and those days like you have just different days where you feel it and you are really motivated to go to the gym and then you have days where you just don't feel like going that's fine but your mind have to be stronger than your feelings <laughs> yeah i really also like these pants if you're putting on really nice gym clothes then it's way easier to go to the gym <laughs> so i will probably see you for dinner this is the creation of my brother oh <laughs> no <laughs> Good morning. Oh my god, my voice. So I woke up in Munich. As you can hear, my allergy is at the edge. Like, can you see this? My eyes. They're all watery and red and I'm just... I feel like I'm sick, but I'm not really sick. It's the worst thing ever. And I can't wear makeup at all. Like, I'm touching my face all the time. And my eyes are red and it's the worst, worst feeling ever. I hate allergies. And I don't have anything. Like, I'm not allergic to anything. But the pollen in the summer is just... It's hitting me. But yeah, I'm going to breakfast now. I think I will end this vlog here because then it's gonna be really hectic and the whole family is gonna just say goodbye. My sister is gonna stay in Munich and we are gonna fly back to Hamburg and I'm gonna fly back on Friday to Sydney. And then I will probably film a morning routine because my morning routine is one of the best you've ever seen. It's It pushes you to do anything and it's just, it's a feel good routine. You feel like a newborn baby afterwards. So I'm gonna definitely film this. I'm missing this routine. I think, yeah, it's just everything. So I'm going to share it with you. And if you have any ideas, please comment. DM me on Instagram and make sure you're going to follow me on TikTok because TikTok is where I started and I love, love, love TikTok. It's just easy going up and just funny, nice videos and where you learn a lot. So trying to post um, motivational videos, but also things about food and stuff. So make sure to follow me there and subscribe my YouTube channel. I'm going to try to post every Sunday from, I don't know what time I'm going to say it on Instagram. <clears throat> but now I'm trying to do one vlog a week to be consistent and because I just love YouTube, I love the platform, I love long videos, so this is a way of getting to know me a little bit better. Also receive so many sweet comments, so really like it. Yeah, make sure to subscribe. I will see you in the next vlog.